Hey my Aquarius, this is Jerba here with Flirty Savage Spirit. I hope that you give this video a thumbs up. Go ahead and already channel that energy that this reading is going to be for you coming in. Also subscribe to my channel. I love you guys a long time. So let's get into your quickie read right now. This is you over here. This is your partner. Overall energy coming into the week and then what's likely to come out of this week. So starting out, there seems to be a little bit of a... I don't know. I feel like someone feels as though that they aren't being seen, being heard. They're not getting the attention, perhaps, that they're wanting to. Or basically feeling like someone here is pulling back, like they're distancing themselves from you. They're letting go or either there actually was a particular actual breakup, I mean, like some type of breakup, whether or not that breakup was get the fuck out or that breakup was I'm just not talking to you for two days. But hey, on the third day, hit me the fuck up, right? So um, it seems like that someone here needs to let go of an ego-ish problem or someone was trying to hold on to someone, you know, so so badly to the point that someone else was feeling suffocated. So someone here needs attention and then the other person may be feeling like the other person is a little bit needy, whichever way that this falls on the board. This could definitely be involving a situation where there is a family unit, a family dynamic of where the kids are involved, the mommy and daddy, um, grandparents, you know, everybody knows each other. Like there seems to be some type of foundation that is actually set here in this particular connection or either someone was wanting um like a celebration or wedding a baby or something to go to a next level and someone here is like really confused about whether or not that's really what they want to do i also get the notion that there may be an issue with with some of you guys of where one person is wanting the other person to either post them more or to actually post them on social media or to acknowledge that they are actually in something with somebody and like this person is a very hesitant to do that like you know why do i need to post you on social media to validate my love you know that i'm I, you know that i'm kicking it with you like why why we need everybody in, in our business you could possibly be dealing with an earth sign that's here that's represented um by um Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo energy. Don't know why I lost my train of thought there. Um, but this is also, I feel like this is more so you that was wanting something that perhaps is a little bit more stable in some kind of way. Or you want to be treated as royalty, you know, which you deserve. You want to be on your throne. But there does seem to be some type of heartache or some type of disappointment. Or either you've been disappointed by this person three times. Or this is the third time that this is actually happening in your particular life so there is you know like a, a real feeling of like this is kind of like gut-wrenching i also kind of take this as you being a little bit confused on how to actually get what you want if this is not you this could also possibly be your partner feeling in this energy right so it just seems as though that there is some type of conflict that is here i also get the notion that some of you guys may be dealing with someone that has like notoriety whether or not they are a social have a social media presence they are celebrity um there are artists rapper singer songwriter you know like something kind of sort of in that music energy um and that's here and maybe that's why this six of ones is also show, showing up here because this could be a very public scenario or situation so your person over here has queen of cups and the two of wands queen of cups of course is representing that water energy but it's also about trying to stabilize their emotions trying to say well hey i have this cup and i'm in motion but i have paused to try to kind of like look and see what's in the distance future and if you see both of these cards like she's staying out to the horizon like thinking and then it's like two of ones is kind of like the same thing we're standing out trying to look to the unknown but we want to see kind of what is going to happen before we actually make this decision we need to figure out which path are we going to actually take so your partner is the person that seems to be very stagnant this week um don't really know exactly what they want to do or they're just not giving you much this week at all it's pretty much basically what i'm getting at right so it's not really like you over here like but no I need to know what's going on and the other person's like well it's going that's all we know and it's like well what the fuck okay <laughs> so and if this again if you're not in that energy don't kill yourself trying to make it be you by cussing me out in the notes in the comments it's okay so the outcome we have you showing up here queen of swords so you start to get your bitch on like you start it's in reverse here so you come at the end of this week 
you start to be like, you know what? Let me say you something, baby boy or baby girl. If you don't want to acknowledge me, if you don't want to take this thing to the next level, if you don't want to compromise, I, I will cut you off. Like, uh, <laughs> you got the right one today. Seven of Pentacles shows up in reverse. So that's still like no planning, no strategy. Like, I'm done. Like, is this this just don't seem like it's going to bear any, any fruit that's here. Ten of Pentacles saddens me because it shows up in reverse. This could be living like week to week, um, you know, financially. This could also mean that uh, family does not, family or friends don't approve of this particular relationship. Or again, it's something about the the family dynamic or, or the kids or the parents, the grandparents or something like that, where it's like a bit of an obstacle that's going on this week. And it seems like maybe perhaps you're heartbroken because this is something that you feel like needs to be dealt with and it's not your ideal situation but your partner is over here like well i mean you can handle it <laughs> you know like you know it's whatever it is is not that serious to your to your partner as to you and it's pissing you off is basically what i'm getting let's get some oracles before we roll up out this quickie read here before we're done and someone goes grab the rag okay uh let's see we say a phone call we have homeless, reunion, and then spontaneous. Up under the deck, we have toxic. So um, I do feel like that this is a situation where if you're waiting on communication from somebody, you'll probably get it. If you put somebody out the house, there's going to be a reunion. It's going to be a bit spontaneous. Um, you're not going to see it coming. Like They might just show up in the middle of the night knocking on your door or calling you saying, hey, I'm outside to try to you know, relieve this whole heartbreak-ish type of situation that you have going on. So that's what I have for you, Aquarius. Seems like that you're going to be on a ride for this week, but this has been your quickie read. And I'll see you guys on the next read. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.